Hi there, everybody. Welcome to Always Stampin' Videos. I'm Kelly Gallfinger, and I really appreciate you watching my videos. I love my subscribers, so thank you for subscribing. Um, please comment and let me know that you're watching, um, and let me know what you think about this video. I appreciate your feedback. Please let it be positive <laughs> and encouraging. So, here we go. Today I'm sharing with you my journals that I have entered into my Etsy shop recently. So um, these journals are so cute and so fun and I hope that this video will just entice you to run over to my Etsy shop, always stampin' on Etsy, and buy them all up. <laughs> so I love these journals. They're tiny. They're perfect for, uh, the perfect size for my um my gym bag a perfect size for my purse um i love throwing one in the car to have just handy for notes and um just things that i want to remember they're just the funnest little journals and there are two signatures in each one of the journals um they make perfect gifts so with christmas coming up you might want to just grab a few while you're in my etsy i don't have a lot of things in my etsy right now um but right now i do have all of these journals ready for your viewing pleasure. So let me get started. I'm going to show you a little flip through of these journals. I have three that are coffee themed. They're so cute. And then I have five here that are just beautiful fall um, florals and pumpkins. And um, I have a discount if you want to purchase all five of these. And then I have a discount if you decide to purchase all three of these. So hop on over to my Etsy and check that out. Always stampin', no space in the middle, no G at the end. Uh, so let's just start with this one here. All right, this one has fun little macaroons on the front. And um, I just think those are so cute. I love these images. I think they're so cute. Um, each journal has two journals. Front. there's uh, two, two of them right there um, and they each each journal has a pocket front and back there are 16 pages in each journal premium um, printer paper so it's nice and smooth perfect for writing perfect for stamping I like to put a little post-it note here post-it note um, pack right here I just peel off the back of my post-it note and um, stick it right here in the center and this just folds around those post-it notes perfectly. Each journal has um, a pocket in the front and a pocket in the back. Oh, this one is stuck. <laughs> Gonna have to fix that. So there's a pocket there in the front and there's a tiny pocket here in the back and then there's a larger pocket all the way here in the back. Um, let's see, each journal has uh, is made with a paper, brown, a paper brown bag. Um, I love making brown bag journals or just paper bag journals. And this one is just fun and adorable. It measures about, um, let's see, four and a half by five inches. Um, well, maybe it's about four inches. Let me see here. Yes, it's four inches by five um, inches. And um, so like I said, it's the perfect little size for um, a bag or glove compartment or anything like that. So here are the other two. Let me just show you what they look like inside because each journal is just a little different. Um, basically the same format, but different papers. Okay, and so I am going to fill up each one of your pockets with little journaling cards and embellishments, stickers, uh, just whatever I can find um, in my stash. I'm going to fill those up for you. So you see there's the pocket there in that journal. And then there's a little pocket filled with a few things already. Um, and so I'm going to fill those pockets up for you. And yeah, like I said, each one of them is just a little different. So let me get this one. And I'm gonna just give you a quick flip through of each one. Uh, on my Etsy shop, they're labeled. Um, there's one listing for both groups and then each journal is listed with a number. So you can pick out your number that you want and just order that number. Or like I said, you can get a discount when you order all of them. These fall ones are so pretty. I love this paper. 
I am somewhat of a paper hoarder. <laughs> and so I have been wanting to make something special with this paper for so long. And these little journals uh, just fit the bill perfectly. So aren't those cute? Look how pretty. Love this paper. And it just makes so, so cute little ideas are just like zooming in my head. A lot of people will ask me, well, what do you use? The, what do you use your journals for? Well, I journal. I actually write in my journals. Sometimes I like to write how I feel or what I'm feeling or what I'm going through. Um, sometimes it's easier to get it out on paper than it is coming out of my mouth. And so, um, yeah, I just, I like to journal my feelings and my emotions. Sometimes if I'm really super happy and I really you know, want to share that, I will write it in my journal. And who knows, maybe someday my kids will look back on those journals and um, really treasure me sharing uh, my emo my feelings and my emotions um, and my, my gratitude. So I use my little journals for gratitude journals. I sometimes will just write down one thing a day that I'm happy for. Um, maybe something happened that something as simple as seeing um, an elderly lady you know, at the grocery store, getting her shopping done and having her, you know, having a good time, just getting her shopping on. <laughs> I, sometimes that just fills me with pleasure knowing that um, people in the world are getting by. And so I will write about that in my journal. And then other times I use them for notes. Like I will take sermon notes or lecture notes um, and things that I wanna remember. I'll use them for quotes, favorite quotes. I, I keep one in my car because as I listen to the radio, you know, I like to jot down um, different things that I might hear to a podcast that I'm, when I'm listening to a podcast, if I hear something that I want to remember, then um, I like to write that down. And so I have one in my car specifically for quotes, inspiring quotes that um, really kind of inspire me and encourage me. So there you have it. Those are my, I call them treasure journals. They're trifold treasure journals. And like I said, you can go to my Etsy shop and check those out. I hope that you like them. And I hope that you'll want to um, just buy up a whole batch and give them to all kinds of people that you know and love. Thanks for watching today and I appreciate you. So I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.